Uh, it's so cloudy, probably gonna rain. Oh no, red hooded woman. Everyone's living a nightmare because of this virus. It's pure suffering that nobody in their right mind could enjoy. But it's all in God's will. Oh, good. We got one of you, do we? Yeah, Alright, everybody, welcome back to Who is Zombie? In case you missed the first episode, upper right corner of the screen, click that, check it out, come on back. So you know what we're up to. Uh, first video went up and you guys enjoyed it, wanted to see a bit more, so I'm perfectly fine with doing a bit more of this. We have an interesting little story building up, a lot of secrets going around. We're in day 7 of apparently maybe a 30 day campaign with 9 different endings depending on the choices you have made thus far. So far everything's going pretty good, there's obviously a lot of sketchiness going around with the NBCs, but um, in terms of my performance, I would say alright. Let's see what day 7 has in store for us though, so we have a little tap tap rattle on our evaluation door maybe? Yeah? There. What? Hey, little one. If you want to be screened, you have to wait outside, okay? This door is for the staff only. You can't come in this way. No, it's not that. I've heard my mom is here. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we also had an event um, where one of the people that we let in told us to keep an eye out on her daughter. Have you seen mommy? She's probably looking for me. As a matter of fact, she is. She told me to keep an eye out for you. What's your name? Laura. Laura Watson. Yep, yep, that's her. That lady who came here a few days ago. She was looking for her daughter called Laura. Huh? This must have been my mom. Yeah. But if you want to get inside, you have to answer a couple of questions. What questions? Hmm. Let's see. Have you been in Santa Maria lately? No. So where have you been? The soldiers gave me a ride to Banfrode and I stay there. Ooh, that's bad. Banfrode is one of our uh, prohibited places to let people in from. Don't you dare. Clear this child's infected him yet. I can't... I mean, come on, think about it. In a real life situation, are you gonna really go ahead and put everybody's life in danger? Apparently, this guy is certain that, he, that she's infected. Hello, darkness, my old friend. I'm sorry, Laura. I know it's gonna be hard, but I just can't let you in, even though I want to. Please stop making it difficult for me. I wanna see my mommy. Let me see my mommy. Sorry, little one. So sorry. You're a rascal. I can't risk everybody's life inside the shelter. September 18, 2033. Massive zombie outbreak in the Oska area. Premeditated attacks suspected. Witnesses report seeing a suspicious individual wearing a red hood. Hmm. Interesting. So quarantine has been lifted from Santa Maria. Now, Oska citizens, out. Oh, oh God, Richard. Uh, I'm gonna have to say no to you with that weapon right there, my friend. All right, my boy, uh, you look, uh, you're looking pretty slim there. Photo's a bit off. Uh-huh, you lost weight? Uh, wait, uh, Veronia's fine. How did you get here, though? I ran all the way here. Mm-hmm. Where did you live, though? Veronia. Okay. Okay. I'm not really feeling that drip from your nose, so you're gonna have to uh, exit the premise. Michelle Morgan, you look so suspicious for some reason. Uh, how did you get here? I just walked here, why? Where have you been re recently? Santa Maria has been lifted recently, so... In you go. NC Lee. How did you get here? I swam across the river, okay, that's fine now that that ban has been lifted. Where have you been recently? I'm from Banff Road. I think that's been lifted now too, so that should be fine. Yeah. Kevin Brook. I don't think that's you, Kevin. Time is Ward. How'd you get here? I had to cross the forest of Veronia to get here. Uh huh. I'm from the beautiful town of Lavoska. Everything seems fine. <laughs> no, my friend, you get out of here with that mustache as well. Oh, I could have probably got another bonus had I done her really quickly. Hey, Abel. 
Are you gonna chew me out about this little girl? Look, I did it for everybody's safety in here, right? Sometimes, you know, you just gotta be the villain to... For the greater, for the greater good. Ugh. You remember what happened this morning? Yep. I think that's what we're gonna follow up on. Yeah, as a matter of fact, I do. Huh? Have you been listening? I'm really distressed. Good job, man. What? It hurts inside. If you start making exceptions in times like this, the situation can quickly get out of hand. Right. That's exactly what I s Yeah, yeah. You can't make exceptions. You'll be proud of yourself. You did the right thing. Uh? <laughs> Why the uh at the end? Uh, okay. Thank you, Belle. I, I was feeling everything you said until that uh? How was your night, Bell? Same as usual, nothing special. Oh, huh, well. I guess it's good news. To be honest, I was afraid you would be mad at me for what happened yesterday. Huh. But since you're stretching and looking cheerful, I guess I'm safe now? Well, I can't be mad at you for that forever. Alright, let's row. Let's do it. I mean, what do you mean for yesterday? I mean, you kind of gave me a good pep talk, right? Unless she was being condescending. So tools are now allowed to pass, but weapons probably still on the no-go list. Citizens using tools for work or livelihood oppose the government's policy. Following the protest, the government issued a revised order allowing shelters to accept citizens with tools provided their use can be justified. I mean, that seems kind of... can't they just lie? Uh, why do you have that hammer there, sir? That's dripping blood. Oh, I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna nail the board up, you know, one of those windows, you know, boards seem a little bit loose, I'm just gonna lay it up. I mean... Oh, okay, that seems justified. Come on in. Okay, let's see here, Kevin Barry. <laughs> I don't think that's a tool, my friend. You, you're gonna have to step, Kevin. Sorry to say. Laura Barry, okay, um... How did you get here? I used the boat and the river brought me here. Is that tool gonna be used for something good? I won't say anything. Oh, but you're from Oscar, though. Never mind. Ha 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 ha! Didn't have to worry about it. Lisa Berry, no. Can't do. Joseph Martin Los Leones, how'd you get here? River? Uh, where have been recently? Los Leones, everything seems good. Welcome aboard, Mr. Mustacho. Elizabeth Martin? Oh my god, Granny, you got it going on still, you know what I'm saying back there? Um, where did you live? Santiago? Okay. Think you're good? She's good. Oh, James Duncan. Silly eyes. Come on in, buddy. Elizabeth Lee Santiago. Is your hand fine? It looks kind of weird. Where'd you live? Santiago. I'm here on foot. Okay. In you go. We have Metacoda. Can we get two more extras? Is that a tool? We need to build barricades. He's from Aventon. Alright, in you go. Fine. One more. Ah, yeah. I am always so close. I'm so close always for that bonus. That wasn't too hard. Yeah, you say that. Knock off Leon Kennedy. Well, our numbers keep growing at least, so that's good. Alan is here. Alan, did you install that lightning rod? Thank you, man. These lightning strikes were starting to stress me out. Hey, then I put that up two days ago. It's isn't your gratitude a little bit late? Ah, <laughs> uh, sorry. Uh, so much has happened in these two days. <laughs> Oh, and by the way, the auxiliary battery. I won't be doing work on it anymore. What? Why? I heard the government is working on the same project. As soon as the research is complete, they will provide the batteries to all civilian shelters. <laughs> wow. Are you saying that you have to... You have completed the work of an entire government research group on your own? And finish before them? I'll have you know I was a government researcher once. These people are a bunch of amateurs who have... Who would have been no match for me back then. Okay, I hear you, Einstein. But if you're so talented, how did you end up here? Oh, when I was there, they took advantage of me. I was sick of them having fun at my expense. So I applied for a field mission. Chief. He begged me with the face of a child that wants candy. <laughs> I still remember his face. Fat raccoon. 
That was badass. I mean, really? This entire conversation was weird as hell. Not badass. I'd, I'd say that that's as far as from badass as you can get. This dude just randomly laughing, haying, <laughs> and giggling, and... Whatever you say, dog. Day 9. Getting pretty good at this. Not even tired. <laughs> this. Greetings. My name is Edward. I'm one of the leaders of the Strength Shelter. Oh, Strength. Hey, nice to meet you. I'm Aiden. Supervisor of the shelter. How can we help you? Lately, our shelter's become overcrowded and we don't have enough men to take care of the external security. So, we thought if there is an experienced soldier among your people, you could come and help us with that. As in Brian? It'd only take about two days. Well, Brian or Bell, right? Well, as you can see, we don't have that much personnel around here either. But if it's only for two days... Yeah, in two days we expect the government reinforcements, so you... Your men could go back in the evening for that day. Uh, please give us some time to think. What should I do? Oh. <laughs> I guess you gotta think about it, but now. Not later. No, we cannot do that. Our situation is bad enough as it is. Everything will be back to normal in a couple of days, won't it? I mean, sure, if you want to call this life that we're living at the moment normal. Huh. Ha ha ha. I mean, I don't, I'm not even sure what the impact of this could be. Let's lend a hand if we can. I see. I'll send someone out there right now. Thank you very much. I'll be waiting in the car. Sure. Who are we sending? Bell. Hey, Bell. What is it, Aiden? Who's that handsome man? Uh oh. Uh, he's one of the leaders of strength. You need to get ready now. You're going out of the mission. Me? Yeah. They have no security personnel. Can you help them out? No problem. Some fresh air might be good for me. Thank you. They said you can come back on the second day in the evening. Only two days? I could stay a little longer. No. No, you're not going to stay a little longer. Be careful. I will, I will. I'll go get ready. Take care. Now, here's the thing. Um, Do we know this guy for sure is part of a strength shelter out there? Do we have any confirmation, any paper, something? Like somebody that could, you know, vouch for him? Or are we just sending out a random female security guard with some dude who's just claiming to be from another shelter in a post-apocalypse. You know what I'm going with this, right? Yo, yo. The government researchers announced that the DNA study of the non-contagious strain innocent had allowed them to develop a vaccine that can cure patients aged 18 and under provided their skin is only partially green. Partially. So... Okay. Uh, you got that perp. You're from Bamfrode? I think you're fine then. Mustachio Joseph Martin, um, how did you get here? I used to boat, and where have you been recently? I'm from Los Leones, everything's fine with you. Uh, Mary Nelson. Oh, partially green, partially green. Um, so I think you're fine, right? Yes, okay. Her body was hidden there, but you can kind of barely see it. Come here on foot. You ran all the way here. I somehow doubt that, my friend, but hey. In you go. What's, uh, what's with that tool? Have you eaten? No, please give me something to eat. I just want to ask about the tool. Anything you want to say? Can I have some water? I'm so thirsty. It's been like, we need to build barricades. Um, I guess you're fine. Lufthuff! No! Mark Green, get on out of here. Linda Moore. Uh, I guess you're fine. Yes. Thomas Ward? How oh, you got here? Veronica? He's from Lavasca, so everything's fine there. Nancy Green. I think you're fine, Ed. Yes. We get one more. Purple hand. Hey. Oh, I can even do him. No, no, let me click. Oh, that was a that was a click in so we could leave because he's the wacky eyes guy. We got two extra, but I mean, I should have really gotten a lot of that last click right there. I was clicking away like you wouldn't believe it. Give me a bonus. Oh no, bonus. So when seven was the objective, nine was the bonus. I guess maybe when 8's the objective, 11 is the bonus now and goes up one as well. Hey Brian, um, how do you feel about that move about uh, <laughs> sending Bell over there? Dude, maybe, alright Brian, can you please put me at ease? Is Strength Shelter really a thing?
Oh no. Okay, I mean, maybe he is it a no. I've been searching for Bell since the morning. All oh, right, you were asleep, so you don't know. Oh no, this this here here it comes right. This morning, Strength asked for help, so we sent Bell. She'll probably be back in two days. I'm sorry, I should have discussed it with you first. No, you did the right thing. It's important to help each other and build good relationships with other shelters. Yeah, let's see, that's what I had in mind. Especially with Strength. They're the most powerful shelter at this moment. Two days is not that long. I can manage it on my own. Thanks for understanding, Brian. It's cool. It was our leader's decision. I'm only following it. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. It is the leader's decision, me. Leader Falcon, or Leader Aiden, whatever. We did good. It's so cloudy, probably gonna rain. Oh no, red hooded woman. Uh, who's there? Huh, just an, ordinary, uh, just an ordinary citizen passing by. Oh, okay. Except you don't look like an ordinary citizen. How can I help you? If you're here for screening, you're too early. Do you like the world we live in now? Excuse me? Of course not. Everyone's living a nightmare because of this virus. It's pure suffering that nobody in their right mind could enjoy. But it's all in God's will. Oh, good. We got one of you, do we? In the face of these hardships, we must humbly accept a new world that is being born before our eyes. What are you talking about? Get out now! I will come back. May you find your salvation. Good. That's what we need. The, um, apocalyptic biblical one to show up here. This world's going crazy. And these nasty cults are making things only worse. Ugh. Oh man, we got a lot of new ones today. Iron Fist. Expel immediately. Zombies of the new kind have been reported to be attacking shelter doors and damaging power systems. That's really good to hear, especially now that we're light in security as well, by the way. Following the permission of the tools, the government now allow the use of weapons. As long as the owner can justify the weapons use, he or she can bring it to the shelter. Oh, <laughs> he's just basically chained up like the Hulk, huh? Okay, um, Barbara Morris, you're looking uh, completely off there. I'm sorry, Grant. Even, even all that junk in the trunk, you're not coming in here. Donald Garcia, everything seems fine. El Romania, in you go. Oof, no. Not sure about that one with that bleeding head. Okay, here we go. Sandra Walker, I guess she got the proper ID. Everything seems fine with Sandra Walker. Ashley Lee Santiago, uh, how'd you get here? The only thing we have to really keep an eye out for, I think, is uh, Oscar, right? Oh, oh, get out of here. Don't let him do it. Mary Smith, perp is fine. Bam, Road has been lifted. I think you're good. Um, Andrew Gray, where have you been recently? Magical place. I think you're good. It's just a partial perp. Googly eyes, in you go, quote unquote. Um, green under 10, Veronia. Fine, partially green. No. Uh, Melissa Morgan, Oska. Oh, Oska, no, 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 sorry. Sorry, little girl. Uh, purpose of the weapon? I will take revenge on the supervisor for kicking me out of my fam. Oh, okay, you're gonna have to go. <laughs> That's not a good reason. Joshua Jenkins, um, Veronia. I guess he's fine. Ah! <gasps> I thought I had a little bit more time to click on that. No, no bonus for five over? So, did I only really get the bonus last time because I was like the, um, that guy was here, like, you know, doing the test if I was a good supervisor or not? Well, if, if for some reason later on in the game we have to sacrifice survivors, we're building them up at least, so there is that. Aiden! Oh, this is serious. What is it? I was tinkering with the gate, trying to add some protection against the latest strains. And we've got a problem. What? I'll need about two days to fix it. Something is wrong with the door's power system. What? I was trying to improve it, so please don't be mad at me. <laughs> What's with the random giggles with Alan? Really? Oh, I'm under so much stress as it is. What can I do? What's done is done now. <laughs> you seem so... He seems so, you know, you know, satisfied with this. Yeah, yeah, you know, I screwed it up. Trouble for you. I'm gonna be gone for a couple of days now. Oh, well. 
No bit of remorse whatsoever. I understand that you were trying to help, and I appreciate that, but... So what? What are we gonna do? We keep working like we usually do. I've applied a temporary fix. So I can go ahead with the screening like I always do? Yes, except for the power charge. It will be smaller than before. <laughs> okay, I see. Oh, I'm so happy to hear that, dude. Thanks a lot. Brian, we need to talk. Yeah? This morning, a weird-looking person came. Probably a member of some cult. What did she say? She said that the zombie virus is all God's will and we should all accept a new world. You know, the typical crap these people say. Don't let their words mislead you, Aiden. I won't. Yeah, no kidding. Um... Shouldn't we be getting Bell back soon, by the way? What? More rain? So yeah, we do have uh, less bar. So we were starting off now with an extra one filled up. Now we got less than the full one to start off with. The sky was so clear yesterday. Huh. Oh, what are you grumbling to yourself? <laughs> Alan? What is it? It's raining and you're not at the lab. Hmm. I know, right? Here, take this. You were just drawing children pictures? What is that? Oh, some kid did it. Okay. Some kid asked me to give it to you. Come on, I'm busy here. So you're right. I thought that was you. Like, you know, this is what you're doing? Instead of over here fixing our broken gaze or just coloring pictures in like a child. Ah, that's a cute little drawing. Among the increasingly tense zombie crisis, many civilian shelters are experiencing labor shortages. Oh, Iron Fist. Get out of here. Don't you dare. Now, Jackson, love Tavin. Uh, I'm gonna have to just let you in, dude. We got less time, so I gotta be more quicker about stuff. Um, green partial, but over 18. Sorry, ma'am. Oh, no, 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 no. Out of here. Uh, weapon four. What do you have this weapon? I'll show them zombies. Oh, but she's from Oska. Never mind. Santa Maria. Ah, uh, no, no, he's got a wound under there. You could kind of see it barely in his shirt. Uh, Oska. Nope. Donald Harris, uh, Verania, everything seems good. No injuries on you either, right? Okay, we met our, our things. So we'd have to even go over. I could just probably chill here if I wanted to and just forget it. El Romania. But I'm not. I'll get the extra survivors I've mentioned. Perp, all around perp, male. Oscar, sorry. What? Wilson. No, dog. No, 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 no. I, I beg to differ. Origin Oscar. Citizens from this place out. It's not, oh, if you're from Oska. Oh, time was still running? I'm upset about that. I'm upset about it. Don't like it. Don't like it at all. Right? I mean, it, it, there's no, like, fine line. There's no fine little, you know, small print. You know how they get you with the small print? Oska out. Unless they're all purple, everything is perfectly fine. No, there's, there's no fine print. You big man. You know what? Belle's back. I'm happy she's back, and it wasn't a bad thing that I did and, you know, got her sacrificed or killed. So I'll accept the game, you know, trolling me. I'll, I'll allow it to do it. Belle, how you doing? Belle, did it go well? Huh, sure, of course it did. Huh, you look so happy. It's nothing, really. Belle, did you go over there and get laid? Hmm? So, <laughs> you know... You know, I'm just saying, still got to get yours during the post-apocalypse, right? Don't know if it's because Belle is back, but the shelter feels refreshed. Think so too? Mm. Well, the mood got somewhat lighter, that's for sure. Yeah, the four of us need to stick together. It's raining, second time in a row. There's no signs of stopping. Hmm. Lawrence is back. Hello, Aiden. Ugh. You welcome me with so much enthusiasm that it feels almost awkward. It's because you're a very awkward dude, Lawrence. <laughs> yeah, hello. You came and this means that today... Hmm, it means I'll be watching you today, too. I see. Well, I wish you success. Oh, and one more thing. What? Do you have any requests for the government? Supplies or manpower? Actually quite low on food, but nothing we can't solve. I see. 
If you need anything, let us know through the newspaper delivery man. You gotta make sure you have basic supplies. People's lives depend on it. <laughs> sure. Mm, that was an intrepid laughter. Hmm. Let's get ready. New strain. Innocent B. Individuals with green and light purple out. Oska has been lifted, so there's no quarantine now. I That should have been lifted with the last one, because then I wouldn't have to deal with that man that I sent away in purple. I'm still salty about it. And, oh, well, we have another quarantine, though. Love Oska. So citizens from this place of origin, so if they're originally from Lavoska out, if they just cross through Lavoska, I guess they're fine, but if they're from there, then no. Large-scale zombie breakout in Lavoska. That's the reason why. Meanwhile, a new strain has been isolated among the patients infected with the innocent strain that was believed to be non-contagious. This new strain has proven to be highly contagious. All citizens should be vigilant. Okay. Well, I'm going to wrap it up here for this one because, um... When we come back next time, I can just jump in and start with our day. Usually this little part here with the interaction with Lawrence, I'd have to do all over again for the next video. So at least now it's taken care of. I'm going to wrap it up here. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed it. If you want to see some more, you know what to do. Let me know. We could definitely come back and do some more of this going forward. As I mentioned, there's nine different endings so far. Things are going pretty good, I guess. And maybe we even get one of those endings as long as you guys want to see more of it. So do let me know and hopefully you guys have enjoyed it. All the information for this game will be down below in case you want to pick it up for yourselves. I'll catch you next time.